Welcome, welcome everybody. You through to the lipstick chat? Yes, as the lipstick chat. Now, before we go through with the video, please subscribe, share, call your friends to share as well. It's very important. Now, that is out of the way. Let's get down to the business. Chineke me, there is something that I, I, I really want to address quickly about the Valentine. Let me warn somebody. Valentine are for people that have money. Valentine not before every tangala nonsense that is flying everywhere. So, having said that, my people, I want to talk to the South African woman. This year, buy your own gift though. Whatever that you want the man to do for you, do it for yourself. Nobody was born to be your own caterpillar. To be. Behind you, buying you gifts. Do it. You do it for yourself. You are busy sitting there demanding. Hey, you see for Valentine, I think I need some flowers and roses. Idiot. You don't even have one cobo. One cobo. And uh -uh, you are demanding flower and, and, and roses. Can you even spell it? Do you know how it's written? My friend, if you want whatever that you want this year, you are going to buy it for yourself. Leave the man alone. Leave him alone, no. You will buy the dress. You buy the whatever cold drink. I don't know if it's wine. You buy whatever gift that you want from your own pocket. Is it that you're working? Huh? If you're not working, how are you now forcing somebody to go and buy you a gift if yourself you cannot afford one? The, you know, the, hey, the sense of entitlement of a South African woman. Jay! Somebody can even repeat it. The way South African women are entitled. Somebody are even opening eyes, starting doing the checklist that somebody should be buying you something. See this year, my brothers from South Africa, please. You see this year, don't even try it. Don't even try it. This year, leave them. 